There was a wonderful series called Spitting Image, which was made across the road. And um, one of the main contributors was, was this guy that I'm going to introduce to you now. He's better known, probably, as Margaret Thatcher. Um, but as I say, tonight is in disguise. Will you please welcome back a warm welcome for Steve Nellon! You know, one of the great things about being an impressionist is that, you know, when it comes to television, you can actually invent your own television programs. I mean, you can have your own celebrity, Big Brother. And Widdicombe. Well, first of all, uh, first of all, can I say to you? Can I say to you? Can I say to you on behalf of the Conservative Party? On behalf of the Conservative Party, I am completely balmy. And the reason I am completely balmy is that when I was a little girl, when I was a little girl, I would always let my mind go wandering. <laughs> Unfortunately, it never came back. <laughs> Political balance. Alan Rickman is a very clever actor. He doesn't have that many lines, but he always makes the most of them by deliberately stressing every single syllable. We can tell what's wrong with somebody by the way they speak. I mean, listen to Johnny Vegas. Listen to Johnny Vegas. Johnny Vegas is clearly suffering from constipation. That's right! I've not been able to go for a week. And as you can hear, it's affecting me whole life. We can't really end without, I think, um, uh, another great TV tradition, the weather forecast. So I'd like to end with tomorrow's weather forecast in, dare I say, the inimitable voice of Mr. Kenneth Williams. Mm -hmm. <laughs> tomorrow, tomorrow, there will be thunder and lightning. The earth shall break in two. We balls of fire from heaven. <laughs> the rest of the day warm with a few showers. <laughs> Your applause, please, for Steve Nellis.